everyone welcome back to rata reading guys if you are new to this channel welcome i'm your tarot reader Ra here thank you so much guys for clicking on this video i really hope you will be enjoying the content of this reading for today today we're going to be looking into the topic of what is the current feeling of the person that you have in your mind so um we're going to be looking more in terms of romantic perspective today more romantic connection here so i already pulled out three cards here so this is going to be group one group two and group three if you want guys you can pause this video meditate and choose the card if not you can intuitively choose whichever that's you are comfortable to do so i just want to remind this is a general reading so take whatever message that resonates with you and leave the rest so now let's get started with group number one group one what is the current feeling of the person that you have in your mind okay we have here eight of pentacles okay there is a sadness energy i'm come uh, i'm getting from this person that you are asking right now eight of pentacles it gives me an energy that this person is kind of having some sort of a trouble to focus so when they think about you they feel this overwhelming love this could be someone that maybe it's been a while for them they never felt this sort of an overwhelming emotion especially in terms of love maybe this person kind of count days counting their days to meet you to see you this person miss missing you a lot i have to say so uh there's also an energy that if you guys are connected in some way i'm seeing this person is uh, eagerly waiting or i would say this person constantly checking whether are you online or is there any sort of an update so i am saying that this person misses you this could be someone that probably could be very controlling i'm seeing um this is someone who just not does not allow their emotion to be showcased openly to everyone so i'm seeing this person is missing you a lot but they having some sort of a trouble to either to express to you openly or this person is is perhaps is finding the right way to show it to you yeah but i am seeing like you have consumed their current your full thoughts that's the current feeling that they have it's like super focused on you group one so let us see we have your endless possibilities number 38 38 could be their age or number three or number eight eight the month of august could be significant here i'm getting an energy that this person perhaps getting some sort of a realization if not uh, maybe a sudden downloads about this connection This person perhaps is trying to find a way to express. That's the energy I'm getting here. This could be someone is actually trying to step out of their comfort zone. So when it comes to you, this person feels a very mixed emotion here because you, someone like a siren here, like you are calling them towards you but it is something that they have to come out of their comfort zone which this is a this is someone who never or probably it's been a while they have done this this is someone perhaps might have a strong earth earth sign on their chart taurus virgo capricorn so this could be someone that has been has built some sort of a comfort you know some sort of a comfort place for them and they've been living in that for a while so since you came in this person's life this emotion kind of calling them out to is either like if if not this could be someone that might be super focused about something that they are creating they are crafting or they are doing right now so i'm saying like you are making them to do some sort of a work here 
If not, I am seeing this person feel like in order for them to connect to you, they have to do some sort of a healing here. Like I am seeing because you kind of really opening up this person's heart chakra. So this person feel like in order for them to come towards you, they have to really overcome some sort of a hole. They, they perhaps might have been hurt in the past. There's some sort of a sadness coming from this person that they have to overcome before they can come clean. Group one. So we have your number 10, you are my everything. So this person definitely want to build some sort of a family here. Like, um, they see a future with you, I have to say. Like, you are everything from this person. Like, they want to settle down with you. They That they want to be your love of your life. Like, they want to be everything for you. That they are, they are kind of figuring out the way how to do so. If not, there could be some sort of a, a, a situation. This can be their own limitation here. Maybe they feel that they should not come forward. Maybe they feel that something is... How could they actually able... To, they, they, they need to express this emotion to you. If not, if there is some sort of a pride... Maybe they take pride of something they, they are doing. So they find it very difficult for them to openly come and show or express the emotions with you. So let us see. Group 1. How this person feels for you. So we have here Knight of Swords. I'm getting an energy that this person feels if this person does not take an action now this person gonna miss something this person could be someone that perhaps never ever showed any sort of an indication to you even they did it could be something very subtle very small like you cannot make up anything out of it but because this is a person who really take their time really take their time before they can commit in something but right now i'm getting an and sudden urge from them like they have to come forward if not something gonna change so i'm seeing here their feelings right now is really really running high they feel that they have to do something they they know that with you they can see this endless possibilities they can really build any sort of a life with you like you are you can you and them can be anything can be anything and can be everything and this person want to come forward and they they know it's need to be now so i'm seeing a sudden sudden and a quick movement from this person yeah but it comes in reverse so this is a hangman so i'm getting an energy that this person is actually coming like really struggling to come from the stuck energy like coming out from the stuck energy they know how to come out, but it's not easy. It is not easy. Maybe this person might have received some sort of news about something that you're going to be doing. Or there's something, uh, some sort of a news or a signal or something that they saw in you. Or they heard from someone about you that you perhaps going to be leaving or something here. They can't really accept the fact that you're going to be leaving them behind. Or they can't really accept the fact what will be the next thing gonna be happening if you're gonna be leaving them so something this person hurt which is really made them to decide to come towards you yeah this person sees you to be a perfect match or they want to be your partner here group one so this is what I'm getting for group one. So let us see for group two now. Group two, we have the hanged man here. Okay, some of you probably might have chose group one. That's the energy that I'm getting. So let us see. Okay, for a lot of you, this could be someone that you might have dealt already. This is like a past person here. This is a, someone from your past. I'm seeing this person is actually feeling the consequences of their action right now.
this is someone that were really stubborn that they were really adamant they do not want to change they do not want to release something so right now i'm seeing this person is trying to be as flexible as they can in order to gain you back to reinstate something in in both of you but it's not working it's not gonna work that's the energy that i'm getting it's give me an energy as if like you perhaps have already cut the cord with this person energetically maybe this person does not feeling your energy anymore around them this this pile i'm heavily picking up a self-sabotage energy coming from this person um what is their current feeling they are trapped they are so trapped with the thought of you how much they feel for you group two if this does not resonate with you guys i would suggest you to choose another card another group or another reading entirely so let us see number 12 number three the month of december could be significant here so we have your into me i see I'm getting an energy of um, this could be a very a very deep uh, message here I'm getting an energy that this person perhaps uh, felt very secured very very belong to you but they did not realize when you were with them or when they are with you uh, they definitely did not allow this in uh, this message to come to them there is an energy of this person was running away from some sort of a truth and it's give me also a, a complete cycle the cycle has been completed has been closed right now perhaps you have literally cut the cords with this person you have moved on what are they feeling what would be their current feeling group two i'm seeing this person miss this uh touch your touch this person uh, misses the intimacy that they had with you the passion that they felt with you because you did not judge them they felt very protected very secured very uh, belong like uh, the intimacy perhaps was really flowy very very intimate i'm saying this person this would uh, was really secured to open but right now it's kind of hitting them because they know that they would never it kind of gives me an energy that they feel that they will never able to find such a intense emotion with anyone else. It's only with you. So your energy is very healing and this person really, really misses that a lot. So they are kind of trapped right now. I'm getting an energy that this person misses you a lot. Your hug, your... Uh, your want the way how you take care of this person how much you care for this person like you really put a lot of thoughts about taking care of this person's emotion here i'm seeing here number four i need more time number four could be significant here this person could be dreaming a lot about you this could be someone that perhaps uh, left you hanging or kind of gave you some sort of uh, reasoning that they need more time right now with the card of i need more time is give me an energy that they kind of stuck with their own reasoning like their own uh, self-sabotage energy here maybe this person were really taking their own sweet time to come forward to kind of offer you some sort of a commitment or to really even uh to acknowledge this connection here right now i'm saying perhaps you does not have time for them or like they are really begging like i'm saying this person is like ban uh, trying to ban themselves in order to at least uh to hear your voice i'm saying but it's not happening for them this person is willing to go any distance in order just to be with you but i'm not saying that's happening and that could be the major reason why they are even feeling very imprisoned by their own action here group two yeah number 12 21 i'm getting 12 
1221 you might have an additional message there i'm getting an angel number yeah two of swords i'm i'm getting an energy that comfort you represent comfort you represent home for this person and something about you definitely bring them back to their childhood like they can be this childlike around you or with you like you never judge them with others it is really difficult they, they has to be always pretend i'm seeing a pretentious energy coming from this person maybe with you group two this person was really wasn't pretending because you never allow them or give them any opportunity to pretend but uh, i'm saying this person did not cherish that right now they are they are struggling they are suffering i'm also getting an energy that this person in a way they are still continuously self-sabotaging which is with the two of swords it gives me an energy that this person is not allowing anyone else also to near them because they are still holding tight to the memories of you we have seven of course yeah they are really confused they are confused because i'm saying this could be someone that perhaps might have reached out to you could have actually attempted to call you i'm seeing everything is kind of failing failed it's not happening they they are kind of run out of uh ways to reach out to to make things happen and it's kind of really uh getting to them like they are like some sort of a fear you know fear of unknown when an, a fear of you not gonna be there in their future is really making them so defensive here like there's some level of denial coming but this denial is not from you it is their own self-sabotage here group two i have to say so this is what I have for you, group two. Let us see for group three here. Group three. Okay, we have here the world. The world. Okay, this is a very, very interesting energy I'm picking up. This could be someone new. This could be someone new that you are asking about. So right away, I'm getting an, a strong feeling this could be a soulmate. This person sees you to be their soulmate, even this is a person who perhaps don't believe in such terms or this person is totally not aware or uh, i'm seeing this person is is kind of learning this could be someone who could be very serious could be very stern someone who could be not into a lot of these things i'm seeing a lot of a matured energy here this could be a very wise or old soul how this person feels about you there's an energy of happiness when it comes up comes to you there's a lot of happiness here the world it gives me an energy of the fool like this person want to take a leap to go into a new adventure to embark into a new adventure with you i'm also getting an energy of the sun like this it's perhaps either your eyes or your laughter is really really capture their heart so this person really want to jump. I'm getting an energy. This person want to jump into this new whole being, this whole existence with you. Feeling the world. Yeah, this person feels the world, right? This person probably... Probably like coming out of some sort of a dark phase of their life i'm getting an energy of that or this person perhaps ended something recently or they are in the verge of completely ending that something behind this could be some sort of a big chapter of their life and they were really sad and that's where you came in in this person's life there's a lot of sign you know this person was really curious about you this person even right now this person feeling very curious very enthusiastic about you maybe initially this person was uh, really closed off this person does not want to open up this person perhaps does not even want to talk to you does not want to 
because there's a lot of fear coming from this person because this person was really alone they were really alone in that dark place and you were the sun you were the sun you you your your present bring a lot of light in this person's life this is a high high level uh, high spiritual connection yeah i have to say this person might have a strong capricorn or if not you perhaps met this person through work or something about their work could be very very significant here i'm open to compromise wow okay maybe there could be some sort of a situation here yeah i'm getting an energy of rejection so when it comes to you this person is someone that's willing to compromise yes this was the exact energy that i got this could be someone that could be quite rigid uh, not rigid this could be someone that has a very strong uh right and wrong or someone who has a lot of uh strong values that they follow this is a very structured person but when it comes to you this person is someone who's willing to see the other way willing to see the other side of things like they are open to listen if this could be someone that maybe uh, they don't have much time if this is a person who's rushing they might have a hectic schedule or something this is a person who don't really open to hear something from others but with you this person is willing to spend their time so I'm getting that this person is willing to tap into the unknown with you here. So you are this a new world to them. What they are feeling about you is something that they are actually feeling right now. There's a joy. There's a lot of happiness. Maybe this person has started to laugh. Maybe this could be something that you can recognize who's this person. Maybe you can hear them laughing more often around you okay yes the death card here this could be a scorpio here or yeah as i said like you you kind of uh help them to come out of this energy or you are being a strong uh a very strong uh pillar even without you knowing like you are a great support system for this person in order for them to overcome this yeah i'm seeing this person perhaps kind of um uh, lost hope perhaps this person thought that this that um uh, that's all nothing gonna happen nothing good gonna come i'm not gonna meet the right people i'm not gonna meet the someone that like maybe this person somehow lost hope in happiness in laughters in joy maybe you came in and you kind of uh bring back everything right i'm seeing here yeah This person is really grateful of you, I have to say. They are really grateful. I'm getting an energy of a sun and a sunflower, right? You are the sun and this person could be a sunflower. So I'm seeing this person could be someone that will try to appear out of nowhere just to be around you in one way or another because they want to be around you so that they can really feel the energy here. You perhaps might appear in this person's life out of nowhere. And I'm seeing an energy that this person really remember every single detail the moment that you guys met. Maybe the first time you guys met. It's, it's really fresh in this person's mind. And I'm seeing perhaps this could be someone tend to replay every time they go to bed before they sleep. Because they really appreciate. They're really grateful of meeting you. Retreat. So this is what I'm getting for you. I really hope this reading resonates with you guys. Let me know. Till then, I will see you on my next reading, guys. Bye-bye.